Welcome back everyone In this video we are talking about the plugin Advanced Mask Advanced Mask is a very simple plugin that is going to help you by making some custom masks in OBS without needing to have any external PNGs or custom made so we are going to see how it works so this is the plugin the plugin page Advanced Mask so let's see how it works let's open our OBS let's take for example this one drag it to OBS now we have our picture here in OBS studio we want to add mask on it now we want to add mask to this picture click on add and select this is a filter advanced mask before you had to use this one image mask blend that we talked about before and then you select an image so for example you you wanted to make this as a circle you select a png circle and open and it's going to apply it so this was before right now with this mask with this filter advanced masks you can add it like this and from here it just gives you some shapes from here let's say for example it says here alpha mask let's keep it like this mask shape you can select shape source image gradient if you want right now we are only talking about shape so let's say circle right now it just applies it as a circle and you can change its properties from here so you can increase the radius like this or the zoom you can decrease the zoom for example like this let's get this back let's take this to default and now once you start it puts it to rectangle let's say for example we want to use heart star and everyone is customizable so let's take a circle let's change center x you can move it like this you can move it make it up and down taking only one part from here and you can decrease the zoom so you can make a bigger part showing like this and you can recenter so this is the whole idea just you select any shape let's say for example regular polygon you can increase the number of sides for this one so let's increase as you can see you can increase it from a triangle until it's like a full circle so this is it and you can also change the radius the corner radius all this stuff are just customizable so both it to default select for example circle so this is going back to your preference do whatever you want to that now you understand how it works it can be applied to any video a webcam or anything that you can apply filters to so that's it for this video and we'll continue in the next one